Hi guys, Shari here. Welcome back to my channel. Well, today guys, I have a fun one for you. One, it's my July favorites, as well as today is a giveaway video. Yes, which is for two people. There are two fragrances for two people. If you watch to the end of the video, you'll find out how you can enter my giveaway. But before that, we're going to be talking about things that I purchased in July that I absolutely, absolutely love. Um, they're not all fragrance um, related. So if you're into like my all fragrance video, which is literally every other video, you can skip this, watch one that I've previously uploaded or wait until my next video upload because this is uh variations of things you have beauty products we have like shoes and we have fragrances as well um if you guys watch me long enough you know that from time to time i will talk about other things other than fragrances that i'm interested in today is one of those days because i think for the month of july i have purchased quite a few fun pieces that I would like to share with you guys but if you prefer when I just talk solely about fragrances then I'm sorry please wait for the other video or watch one of my previous video although I would suggest watching this video because there is a fragrance giveaway at the end Wow without further ado let's begin the first thing I'm looking at here which I'm kind of embarrassed to show you guys because I it's like super filthy, but it's a real gem and I feel like it needs to be spoken about, although everybody I think knows it already. This is the Diamond Bond Bomb How Many Carrots by Rihanna. The pack, um, it looks like this, packaging looks like this, you know, very, it's a nice like pinkish glittery thing however the glitter on this is i don't want to blind you guys to die for as you can see mine is filthy and that's because it's white i would say or, or you know silvery the original looking color for it but if you're placing it on your face and you have like foundation and you're picking it up putting it and putting it back you're gonna have like foundation transfer onto this because it is like so white so that's my only downfall to it that you can it you know it looks dirty after just one use but I mean the glitter on it is I don't know if you can see that where can I put this where you can see it it just is so pretty it's not like any other highlighter that I've had before I don't know if you can see it just sparkles is so pretty i picked this one up at sephora i believe it was like 36 dollars you won't find sale on it but i feel like it's worth every penny let's continue with rihanna another one that i like this is also filthy as af i don't have the packaging for this i actually got this from my daughter this is like a little bit of a cheat i got this from my daughter for mother's day but i didn't really have any interest of using it until like this month because I have other highlighters but I pick it up this one and I love it I love it for like nose highlighting I don't know I just feel like it this should be very well in the for the nose this is how that looks it's very small I don't know if it's like a mini size I didn't purchase this myself like I say I'll show you to you here I was trying to clean it off for you Can you see? I don't know. Yeah. Very pretty. And this one is called Star Struck. And this is from Fenty Beauty as well. This is the matchstick. The one that I have on my lips today is from Tarte, which I love. This one is called Yachin. Beautiful, like burgundy, but also could fit like nude for a dark skin, like my skin complexion. It looks pretty nude, but it's like a burgundy tone. Very, very pretty. Very, very moisturizing. Wears very well and um, dies out very well. So, like, it fades well. It's not like choppy choppy at the end. Packaging looks like this. Like, um, it's called Rainforest of the Sea. Um, Color Splash Lipstick by Tarte love this as well um this one i it's actually like a good 
a very good find. I saw this at Burlington. It was on clearance for $12. I think they were trying to sell it for $30. This is by Estee Lauder. This is Nutritious Vitality 8 Radiant Energy Lotion Fresh Moist. This I love, especially now for the summertime. Because with summertime, when you put like moisturizer that's like very like, um, like, petroleum based or you know very creamy it tends to makes you sweat more it tends to makes you look very oily so i like the fact that this moisturizes my skin with a, and eliminate the oil factor it just moisturizes to dry so uh, my skin feels nice and replenished but it doesn't look look oily so this was a fantastic find for me by estee lauder i don't know what the retail price is but i found this at burlington for 12 dollars this one was also a very good find. I found I found this at Marshalls. I think it was on sale for like six dollars. This was this is Bare Minerals Blemishing Remedy Mattifying Prep Gel. Another one that I love to wear. I like to wear these combos together because it gives me the matte feel, which I like for the summertime. I hate like anything oily because it just makes me feel greasy and feel like a mess for the summertime, especially when you sweat. So I like mattifying things. So this is like a good primer. To wear before your makeup to make the uh, foundation lie nicely and it like blot out any imperfection I like this a uh, ton load and for six dollars you can't go wrong with that that was a Marshall find that the two my two favorite July purchases where fragrance is concerned are girl is terracotta by girl on and um, Valentina Donna aqua by Valentina Donna Aqua by Valentina. Bottle looks like this for the terracotta. Smells like vacation in a bottle. Uh, it doesn't smell like, but gives me the same vibes as the LA Saab um, Lip Farm Resort Collection. Just gives me like living your best life, um, chilling at a resort, very nice vacation, summer scent. This one is a little bit easier to wear than the L Perform. It's a little bit more chill, doesn't seem too fruity as the other one. It more has like a um, skin tan, um, coconut type feel. This one is like a super sexy scent, very fruity, very creamy, very lusty type scent. Really love this one by uh, Valentino, the Valentino Donna Aqua. So those were my two favorite uh, fragrances for um, July finds. Now, let's back you guys up a little bit because I gotta go get some shoes, so we need a little bit of space. The first shoes is from uh, Sophia Webster. I got this at Nether Porter for like hella sale. Retail, I think $3.75 and I picked it up for $112 with no tax and no um shipping fees so it was just like a straight 112 price a stunning shoes beautiful beautiful like party birthday wedding type shoes we know sophia webster is like a luxury shoes this reminds me a lot like jimmy choo minus the jimmy choo price tag you know those jimmy choo like sparkly shoes the heel is outrageous it smells fantastic. It's one of my favorite things. I just like looking at it. It just makes me very happy. And packaging is like this uh, pinky color. It comes with the shoe bag. comes with um, the Netta Porta booklet. I think this is like a receipt and like um, return shipping things inside there. And another one very similar but i think more practical for me to wear i think that would be like i saved that for like a birthday win i'm not going to be walking up and down but i want to be extremely fancy this one gives the same vibes only i could walk in this this is from vs spiga and i got this from the vs spiga website and this one i believe i paid like 80 dollars for it it, had, it was like maybe a hundred dollars and i went sometimes this is a fun thing too 
just doing a Google and Jane, whatever website you're shopping on and see if there's any coupon there. Sometimes you can find it from retail. Is it called retail mart? I think so. Retail mart. You can find sometimes coupons and that's exactly what I found. I found a coupon on retail mall for this website, which was I think 20% down. So I got the shoes for like $80. Another stunning pair of shoes. This one has like, a, it's not a bright silver. It most, it has like a, uh, like a dullness to it. Still glitter to the gods. We know I love glitter, beautiful shoes. Heel is a little bit more practical for me to wear. But still, such a nice, well-made, sparkly shoes. Made, you know, Via Spiga makes wonderful shoes. This is made in Italy. So, yeah, this was another wonderful find. Also comes with a shoe bag and such. Boxing is, is okay. Very minimalistic. Not as nice as the Sophia Webster box. But the shoes is just as fabulous. And I want to say way more comfortable than the uh, Sophia Webster. Um, another wonderful July find was actually from Burlington Online. I found these Donna Karen uh, mules. I love mules. I live in mules. I love, love mules. And this one was just too fancy to give up. This is um, like a bronzy color, bronzy color meal. I got this, I want to say, guys, for like $29. It was $50. Burlington had it for, and it was in clearance of meals because it could look very dressy and it could be very dressed down. I could wear this, you know, with a dress. I could wear these with the jeans and a white tee. It, I just like the versatility of meals. So this was a wonderful find, wonderful price. $29 for the Donna Karen. Also comes with shoe bag. This box was beat up, but I didn't really care. You know, comes in a box, so that's great. Because, you know, not all the time, shoes from Burlington comes in a box. And last, but certainly not least, this is from TJ Maxx. Actually, it says it here. I don't know if you can see it. Got this online for, it was on clearance, $90. And this is from Stuart Weitzman. Now, Stuart Weitzman for $90. I mean, absurd. This is a beautiful meal as well. I don't think it's as comfortable as the Donna Karen, just because the way it's cut, if you have flat foot, it's, it's going to be you know you're just gonna have to do some stretching of it but it makes your foot look super sexy the color of it makes your foot look very sexy and elegant only thing it will be a little bit uncomfortable because the way it cuts whereas the donna Karen come all the way down so it comes over the the fatness of your foot this cuts right in the fatness of your foot so it feels a little bit snug which i feel like will wear out over time However, the way how it cuts makes your foot look sexier, in my opinion. Still a gorgeous shoe. Love it to death. You guys know I love sparkles. This is no exception. I love the black sequin. Same scenario as the Donna Karen you could do with this. So, yeah. That's my July favorites. Now, on to the fun stuff for you guys have been waiting for, and that's the giveaway. If you know that I love Catherine Muddles, you know, Romance the Profense. We know I talk about this all the time. Unfortunately, I don't see this much in Century 21 like I did before. But that's where I usually pick it up for $20 a bottle, which is hella cheap comparing if you were supposed to buy this at Macy's or anywhere else. So for $20, this was an absolute steal, but I don't see it much at Century 21. But I talk about it a lot. Very similar to the Lancome fragrance, La Vie Bell. If you like that fragrance, you will love this. And another one that I talk about that I love that I, I have quite a few backup fragrances for as well as the Catherine Malagino. The Wild Fox Eau de Parfum. I love this scent. It's just very fancy. Very fun. The bottle is gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous bottle. To have quite a few backup bottles, gift sets, the whole shebang where this is concerned. I love this scent as well. I'm giving one full bottle, 3.4 ounce of the Catherine Molly Drino Romance de Provence, as well as a full 3.4 ounce bottle of the Wild Fox. 
no decans no sampler no 1.7 ounce full 3.4 ounce on both fragrances the retail prices on them are usually like 78 to 100 dollars um for 3.4 bottles for either wild fox or for the Catherine malagina both of them are very good fragrances i've spoken about both of them um a lot Catherine malagina more so than the wild fox nevertheless i own both of them in my collection not just one bottle but numerous so i'm giving you fragrances that i love true to myself not one that i'm just trying to get rid of and i promise you guys after my thousand which is long overdue thousand subscribers that i will do a giveaway so this is a long overdue giveaway um i'm gonna try to make it as simple as possible you don't need to subscribe to my um instagram account you just need to be subscribed to my um youtube account um if you are subscribed to my instagram account that's be fantastic i'll greatly appreciate it um i do do fragrances of the day sense of the day on my instagram account but it's not a mandatory thing to um to enter in the giveaway you just have to be um subscribe to my youtube account however the only way that i can have a like a good conversation with you is through instagram because there's no personal conversation i don't think in my my um youtube so you just have to dm me you know um on my youtube on my um on my instagram to tell me that you're a member of you you know you, you watch my youtube videos blah 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 whatever you want to write dm me once you dm me it's saying that you are a subscriber of mine you're automatically entered into the giveaway that's it as long as you dm me saying you are a subscriber of mine of my on my youtube video you're automatically entered into my giveaway and i'll you know raff, do a raffle with everybody that have entered my giveaway give this video a thumbs up like share if you like but mainly you have to send me a, um a dm on my instagram because that's the only way i can have a private conversation with you get your um your you know your email address if you win or whatever it just seems it's just very easier for me to do that way i suppose to email or whatever it's just very easier for me to have a conversation with you a private conversation via dm to get your personal information to ship this out to you so that's all you have to do if it means that you have to beg borrow whatever a friend to dm me do whatever you have to do you as long as you communicate with me through a dm via instagram you're entered into the giveaway and that's it another thing i'm sorry but you just have to have a u.s address i tried to make this international it is not very easy it is not very easy not for me as a small um i'm just gonna be very honest with you guys as a small youtuber i don't get paid for this this is just all of pure love pure fun and just want to share fragrances with you guys so i don't get paid to do the giveaways this is all solely from my income from my pocket so for me it's just not very easy to ship a fragrance that i get on clearance to somebody that's outside of the country that i'm gonna pay now 100 and something dollars to ship i appreciate the love from my international subscriber so my apologies if you're from overseas if you watch me i really hope you understand and still support me and one day when this channel is bigger and i'm more financially capable of shipping fragrances overseas i will but until then i'm sorry this is just for um u.s based audience so that's pretty much it just have to have a u.s address and just have to dm me via instagram and those that's the only two requirements to win either and it'll be two winners not one but two winners and that's all thank so yeah just uh thank you for the support i see you guys in the next video i can't believe i'm over a thousand subscribers i know i know it's been a while and i'm still like in awe of it but i really appreciate that anyways thank you so much i see you guys in the next video bye